the Owlet Dream Sock. It's a baby monitor that offers algorithmic and data collection to hopefully give more insight into what's going on with their sleep. It comes in four different colors. Essentially the heart of this is the data collection and evaluating the sleep status is the key to it. More on that a little bit later. But first, what's in the box? It comes with a puck, a USB charging cable for the charging station which I refer to as a puck. And it comes with two pairs of socks. One pair is for small infant, and one pair is for larger baby up to 30 pounds. It also comes with a charging brick. What's nice about the, the four different sock options is that the sensor is made to be removed um, and switched between different socks. It's also good for if you need to clean the socks or to keep the socks clean over time, you can remove the electronics and uh, follow the instructions for cleaning the socks off. The sensor is built to magnetically attach to the base station. Basically, that part that sticks out goes into the divot on the base station and snaps in magnetically. We didn't have much luck getting a good picture of what it looks like on, so I'm going to use the box to show how they've put the sock on the baby for monitoring. In the end, this one found the charging puck way more interesting than the sock. Yeah. So here's the real heart of the product in the app, is evaluating the sleep status. There are four things it's going to pick up on for indicators. The heart rate, the average O2 over a 10 minute period, the movement, and the number of wakings. And then it's going to use all this to feed into its own decision engine to say, was the sleep peaceful, aka good sleep, or was the baby really active and getting poor sleep? In which case, the parent probably too is also having a bad night. You can go by day to see each sleep segment and how long the sleep lasted, the heart rate, and in the graph details, you can see the sleep status change from light to deep taking all those indicators, putting them together and saying your baby slept lightly, then deeply, then lightly, then deeply, and so on, or deeply and, you know, woke up really happy, which would be great. And lastly, it does software updates over the internet, but don't do this right before bed because they take a while to be applied. So in terms of price, yes, um, you can get it directly from the manufacturer, the Owlet website listed at 349 I found it cheaper at Best Buy. For $2.99. So overall, this does provide better insight into uh, sleep disturbances than a traditional monitor, and it tries to help you identify quality sleep versus sleep that is not going to be as restorative. It comes with different sock sizes, which is great as your child grows, and it's easy to attach to monitor, so there's no question about where do I plug this in and how do I unplug it before I get it ready for bed and all that stuff. Much like my dancing abilities, it's able to position on either foot. On the dislike side, having to put it on can be challenging, and getting it put on correctly can be challenging. All the embedded electronics running in the sock so closely to the child at night is uh, kind of a trade-off, I would say. Less of a dislike, but more of a trade-off for the data you're going to get. It doesn't really do anything or offer any way to turn on an automation in terms of something that might soothe your baby when sleep disturbances occur. And it's on the higher end price for monitors. But overall, if your child's having any kind of sleep issues or if the parent has any kind of concerns about it, um, this is a really useful window into what's going on and can be even more useful in conjunction with a sleep doctor.